guys, my name is Lauren and I'm a software engineer here at Sunrise Integration. In today's video, we're going to talk about Recharge, which is a subscription service that you can integrate with your e-commerce store. We're going to go through the steps to setting up your Recharge account, adding products, some of the do's and don'ts, and why a subscription-based service and model is great for your e-commerce store. Let's get started. Recharge's subscription services offer a seamless buying experience for your customers, which can increase brand loyalty and lifetime customer value. You can manage your subscription business straight from Recharge's merchant portal, while your customers can fully manage their subscriptions straight from your store. You can allow your customers to skip or reschedule deliveries, swap out products, and so much more thanks to Recharge's powerful integration. The setup only takes minutes and can be connected to your current store and any tech. Recharge can be set up on a variety of e-commerce platforms, but today I'm going to go through an integration with a Shopify store. You can find the Recharge app on the Shopify app store and install it to your site to get started. Shopify does require that you have your payment methods set up before you start offering a subscription-based product. If you are using a development store, you may need to go into your settings and set up a payment method before you can get started with using Recharge. Let's add a subscription-based product to our Recharge account. Before you can add your first product, Recharge will ask you a few more questions just to get an idea of what kind of subscription you would like to use for this product. And then you can start adding. I'm going to select a bar of soap from my little home goods store. And Recharge is great because it lets you customize everything from the type of subscription to what kind of discount you might wanna offer your customers for subscribing, as well as the frequency of when the subscription will renew. Perfect, once you're happy, we can hit next. And then Recharge gives a great tutorial on how to add this widget to your Shopify theme. Let's go through that together. We'll head back to our customized theme section of our Shopify store, and you will want to edit specifically your product page. So you can go down here to add a new block, and you should see the Recharge subscription widget will already appear for you, so let's hit that. Now we can drag and drop this wherever we want. I'm gonna put it under the buy buttons and let's see how that looks. I'm gonna say maybe we pop it up above the buy buttons right under quantity. And, and yep, I think that looks great. Now let's head back to recharge where we can verify that we have installed the widget correctly. And then before hitting publish, we can preview our site and even test out adding these to the cart just as a customer would, either the one-time purchase or the subscription offer. And once you're happy, you can hit publish and congratulations, you have added your first subscription-based product through Recharge. And if you wanna ever go back and edit any of those choices or add more products, you can use Recharge's app and control all of those things from their great homepage admin. Now that we've added products to Recharge, let's customize our storefront. Recharge lets you customize both the customer portal and the subscription widget we just added to Shopify on the product page. Recharge already has two themes built in for the customer portal, and they give you so many options on how your customer interacts with the portal. Everything from changing their delivery date to reactivating or canceling their subscription. Recharge also has built-in cancellation reasons and allows you to add incentives for your customers so that you can track why people are canceling and even try to convince them to stay on the subscription. If you want to customize your customer portal even further, you can add your own HTML or CSS, but this can get a little more complicated, especially if you choose not to host the customer portal using Shopify or Recharge. But not to worry, Recharge has incredible documentation that you can use no matter what e-commerce platform that you're integrating with. 
you can see right up here what the help documentation is meant for, and you can use this to further implement Recharge with your subscription model and your e-commerce platform. I hope today's video has answered all of your questions about Recharge and convinced you that this is the subscription service to use for your e-commerce store. If you have any further questions or if you would like help with your integration, please reach out to our team of experts here at Sunrise because we are ready to help. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe to our channel for more helpful e-commerce tips coming out soon.